Hey guys, it's the RV guy here again. Today we're gonna to try to do the ultimate test. I always get questions of which uh, shower head is better. So today I took a standard shower head and then the two oxygenic most popular shower heads and we're gonna test them. Um, I'll show you guys how we're gonna test them. It's gonna be a very fair test uh, for each uh, item and hopefully we come up with results and you see what you like better and what's better for you. So for our test today, we will be using, I do have a um, SureFlow water pump here that I use for my winterizing. So it's just a SureFlow. It does have a little remote. It makes it easier for me. So we're gonna use this. It does have a little hose. On the end of the hose, we do have a filter. We're gonna put that filter in a bucket and I'm gonna fill this bucket each time uh, we start our test. From here, we're gonna hook it up to our hoses and it's gonna go to our three shower heads. So for today, we do have the Oxygenic shower head that's a little alien. We have the normal shower head. Yes, this is in bronze, but it comes in white, comes in black. Usually this is kind of what the campers come with. And then we have the other Oxygenic head that's a little more fancy. We do have our 12 volt battery and hookups. And we're gonna make sure that our voltage is gonna be approximately the same for testing all three, and that way we won't cheat anybody out. Okay, so I hooked up our battery. At the moment, it says 12.4. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. Because of LEDs, it usually flashes. So I do have this little remote that I can turn on and off. <laughs> what we have is a SureFlow water pump, which gives out about 50 PSI. To 55. This is the same kind of pump that you'll find in almost every RV. So it's a really easy way to check and see. I'm not hooking up to city water. I'm not changing the pressure. I'm not changing the volume of water. So I'm going to show you guys. I'm going to use all three heads. Um, yes, the third head for some reason doesn't want to hook up to my regular hose. So I'm also using the hose from that, but that's the only difference. And I'll show you guys just the difference of how far it goes. So I'm going to start off here in this corner and I'm gonna to aim towards the tree and I'll show you guys, we're gonna start with the uh, regular um, hose that comes with the RV. Make sure that our filter's all the way at the bottom. And I'm gonna turn it on. This is now locked, this is unlocked. So as you see, you know, I can tilt it, but that's basically it. Let's go to the alien head. This is our second choice. Can turn it on. So, substantially better. I'm sure you guys can see, again, I can tilt it down. Even I can tilt it up. We're getting all the way to the tree giving a nice bath for the area. And then we're gonna to go to our third one. Our third one has five different options of water pressure on it. And I'm gonna show you guys from zero till five. So we're gonna start with, this is one, this is two, three, four and five. So four and five are a lot like the original. Three, two, and one are a little bit better. And again, it gives you more options than just the other shower head, but I do like the other shower head a little bit more. Hopefully this helped you guys choose which uh, shower head is better for you in your circumstances. But I can obviously say that the original one is nothing like the oxygenic ones. So if you guys still have your original one and you're getting bummed because your shower pressure is very low, just replace it. It doesn't even matter what, which one, you'll have better water pressure, but I would choose the alien one. I don't even know why. Uh, originally, I always went with the fancy one because I think it looks better, but I think the alien one does a better job. So hopefully that helped you guys. Uh, if you guys can, like, share, subscribe. I will have down in the listing 
I'll have all three shower heads just in case you want to buy one that doesn't do anything. But the two oxygenic are also going to be down there and you can choose and hopefully that helped a lot. Thank you. Have a great day. Hopefully you enjoyed this short video. If you did, like, share, and subscribe. Have a great day.